What's going on everybody? It's your favorite alien YouTuber here from planet Kepler 2B here to bring you fellow earthlings over there on that big blue planet of yours some daily dosage of internet content. After all, that's what I'm here providing you for. You know, I'm here to provide you guys some of the greatest YouTube content ever known to mankind, literally, because I'm not a human after all. So then, today's topic of the video is going to be the new information that I got secretly on Pokemon Scarlet and Red Violet Cake, you know, people. I'm the only one that has this insider information. And don't worry, I will be explaining those details later on. It's going to be like the Area 51 of secrets, people, because only I know it. Okay, I'm like the men in black of Pokemon, people, trust me. Okay, I know what's going on. So, guys, we have some interesting new gameplay and stuff to show us about Pokemon Scarlet and Red Violet Head. So, as you already know, there's a fellow favorite YouTuber on the platform who talks about Pokemon all day. And I gotta tell you, his content is absolutely great, people. Me and him see eye to eye a lot. We've never had any issues in the past before. You know, we speak it out like best buddies always do, you know. We settle our differences even when there isn't no differences to settle. We're like two peas in the same green pie. And everyone knows who I'm talking about. It's everyone's favorite Poketuber, you know, Wolfman. Verlicify people. Him and that little avatar that he has of a wolf guy. Isn't it just great? Now, as you already know, Verlicify makes some of the greatest Poketuber content on this planet. I mean, come on now. I mean, who else do you know is as consistent with their great daily uploads with content such as stuff like this? Or this. And don't forget about this. See, people? Isn't this content just absolutely phenomenal? He's so full of positive energy, you know, radiating such great goodness to everyone around him. He truly inspires me to be a better man. Now, guys, let's get into the secret gameplay development that we have on Pokemon Scarlet and Red Violet Cake, after all, because Verlicify said that it's shaping up to be the greatest Pokemon game ever, and I totally agree with him. Well, actually, I really don't, because Verlicify is completely wrong about that. It's not shaping up to be the greatest Pokemon game ever. It already is the greatest Pokemon game ever, people, and you want to know why? Well, I can't give you an exact fucking reason why, because there's no gameplay or nothing for it yet. But isn't that perfect? That's what most games are like nowadays. There's barely any gameplay ever shown, and there's barely any gameplay once it drops. I mean, just look at most Sony games, after all. Now, obviously, people, Sony is a great company, after all. I mean... They really do make some great games like God of War, you know, The Last of Us. But The Last of Us Part 2 was absolute doo-doo. Being that serious. So, people, what does that mean? Well, it means that you can just make any damn game that you want nowadays. And that's exactly what's happening with Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. It's like with Sword and Shield. It's going to be that situation all over again. And you can tell, you know, because obviously Legends Arceus was garbage. And they should follow the same trope that Sword and Shield did, which is to have the bare minimum content and a shallow story with shallow gameplay and shallow graphics. That's what people love. That's what us fans want. We want all of this, right, people? Hoorah! Now raise your hand with me if you think this is the kind of Pokemon game we want. Something that doesn't change up the formula. Like with the new Call of Duty games. Come on now, people. I mean, obviously, since Vanguard was the highest selling game, that means Pokemon can do the same thing and become the highest selling game too, right? Just make another Sword and Shield. There we go. And everyone's issues are solved. We are all happy. But Verlicify also thinks of another thing. He thinks Scarlet and Violet is like a dessert. And I want to know what a dessert is like when it's put in the hands of a master class company. You know, a master chef of a company such as Game Peeps. You know, or Game Dweebs. There we go. That's a much better name for them because they sit up all day on their computer coding stuff like Game Geeks. There we go. 
Now then, I want to know what Scarlet and Violet Red Velvet Cake would be exactly like once it's turned into the masterpiece of a dessert that it should be. I need to know what it's like and try it right away. I cannot wait till it drops in the next few weeks, people. Mmm, I'm hungry for this dessert. I just need to know what this game is exactly like. Just sink my teeth into this meaty dessert surprise. Now then, people, here's to showing you guys the secret gameplay that I have on Pokemon Scarlet and Red Velvet Head, after all. Because my father, my uncle, my auntie, and my brother, and don't even forget about my stepbrother, also works for Nintendo, people. Trust me, I know what I'm talking about. I have insider information on every game Nintendo will release soon. And plus, I have my own company called Pretendo and Quintendo. Those are the two baby companies from Nin and Chintendo, you know, that I own specifically myself. And that's how I know that I have developer information on what goes on. So I'm allowed to show you guys the secret gameplay. So with me shutting the hell up for once and telling you guys what's going on, here's your gameplay for Scarlet and Violet, people. That will soon drop. So, people, did I get you guys excited and riled up like people were during Elden Ring hype, or better yet, during Cyberpunk 2077? Because that's exactly what Scarlet and Violet Redhead will be like. It'll be just like Cyberpunk 2077, not Elden Ring. Because who the hell wants to be... Who the hell wants a marriage ring called Elden, after all? Come on now, people. Why would you ever buy your wife an Elden Ring? We want something like Cyberpunk 2077 because at heart, we are all just punks after all. But don't worry, we're the good punks. We're cyberpunks. Now then, people, in the year 2077, this is exactly what happens. Scarlet and Violet becomes the greatest game ever. It becomes an absolute game changer, no pun intended, of a Pokemon title after all. It's going to shape the landmark of gaming for years to come. Kind of like how older games back in 1998 did, like System Shock, Half-Life, and many, many others. Now then, people, as you already know, Cyberpunk 2077, when it had a lot of hype surrounding it, oh boy, did it absolutely surprise people once it dropped. Oh man, it shook people off their feet. And that's exactly what Scarlet and Violet will do. It's trying to send the sh it's trying to send the the uh same ripples that Cyberpunk 2077 and CD Projekt Red did back during their marketing and game dropping of Cyberpunk. Now, don't worry, people. That means your that means your satisfaction and is guaranteed. 
also you can have your money back if you agree to my terms and service to give me your house and children if you do not like your product. Once Scarlet and Violet drops, though, I guarantee you, you will love the product, and we won't ever have to worry about disclosing this agreement for you to sell me your house and kids, after all, people. Come on, now. There we go. You won't even have to give me your left kidney, after all, if you don't like this product, because everyone will love Scarlet and Violet. I can tell because after showing you guys this gameplay, I can tell that you all absolutely loved it. Now, with that being said, I have a company to run. So, I will see you all in the next video where I show you guys my new Pokemon game that will soon be dropping. It's not made by Game Freak. It's made by me and Verlicify ourselves. It's called Pokemon Quattro Million. Wolfie absolutely cheated, people. And that's what it'll be about. It'll be about the grand adventures of a man named Wolfie who goes around finding Pokemon that are just somehow hacked. And a man who starts with a V in his name goes around slandering him just for getting these Pokemon that he thinks are hacked. Now then, with that being said, this is your favorite alien. Going back to my mothership.